off work sports, early morning talk. It's pretty nuts out here, right? You see the team I'm showing. You see the expectations for next year. Everybody knows Clippers, Lakers. Those are the favorites. You know, Houston's a close third now with the Russell Harden duo. But now, already, it's August and things have changed. The LA Lakers, a lineup that consists of, as you can see, they signed Coach Just Tonka Copa as a young talent, 6'10. Can he be like his brother? Hey, I, I agree with that. Trump on that even though he's not abendestrous as his brother is. Avery Bradley picked up. Strong defensive guard, a vet. Can he return to form? His Boston form is what I mean. Devontae Kilk is coming into training camp. Okay, uh, Kaycock, he had a good uh, summer league. A pretty good summer league. That's why he's in 6'7", but remember 240, burly body. Contavious Caldwell Pope is still there. Jordan Caroline, can he make the team? Alex Caruso's there. Quinn Cook, again, here goes the animal. DeMarcus Cousins. We'll get to this in a second. We know what's happening here, man. ACL injury. The game has changed. I thought he would be the third runner. I thought he'd be the third guy to kind of compete and make this team special. Okay? It was LeBron. It was AD. And my expectation was Cousins over Kuzma, even though Kuzma has the potential to be a threat just like DeMarcus Cousins. Let's get into the next. Troy Daniels picked up, again, a defensive-minded guard. Anthony Davis, Jared Dully, vet, Danny Green, your guard position. Eric, Hol Eric Holman, let's see what he can do. Maybe he gets an opportunity, but I think he'll be on the practice squad. Maybe in a 10-way contract, right? G League, back and forth, two-way contract, I mean. Taylor Horton Tucker, let's see what happens there. Hasn't played. Demetrius Jackson it is it's signed to the Summer League. LeBron James, Kyle Kuzma, Javal McGee, Zach Norrell Jr., the pickup out of Gonzaga, Rajon Rondo. Okay, so the lineup looks okay now. But when you when you take out DeMarcus Cousins, when you take out DeMarcus Cousins, there's problems. And I am worried about a guy by the name of KD. KD has the same Achilles injury as DeMarcus Cousins has. And you can see the repercussions or the after effect of the Achilles injury. Let's make no mistake about it. DeMarcus rushed back last year. He wanted to be in there. He started to play. Then he lost a lot of weight, a lot of stress on the body. They're thinking that the body's the same. But no, think about, think about the Achilles as one tire on your four-wheel drive vehicle with no tread. And you get a hole in it. And they patch up the hole, okay? Yeah, you can still ride. It's still driving, but it's not the same tire. DeMarcus, your Achilles is no longer the same. And I think overworking it, overstressing it caused some problems. He wanted to be a better self, and he wanted a big contract for next year. My apologies to him. I think he'll come back. But Jesus Christ, what a, what a last three years for DeMarcus Cousins. Now... What do the Lakers do? Lakers Nation. Lakers Nation, what do you do? Melo has been talking a lot on social media, on ESPN. That's right. Carmelo Anthony has been in a whirlwind of media talks. It's one roster spot open. Do you try to get another big? I mean... I don't believe Kenneth Farid is re-signed. There's several other guys who I think they need. They need the Rodman guy. I don't know who that is, right? I don't know who Rodman is for them. So there has to be a guy who rebounds and block shots. I know McGee's there. Tyson Chandler's a little bit too old to be able to be his constructive self as he used to be. Maybe in short minutes he can give you some spurts. But they need the big rebounding guy, Leaper. I don't see that on this team, and maybe they'll pick that up. Costas is not that, is not that, but does he have the mind and skill set to be able to get in a position? He definitely has a length, doesn't have the size. We'll have to see, but for me, I need a third punch. I know Kuzma's there. I get it. 19 points a game. You say Kuzma's a third punch, bro. Shut up. I just don't think he's, he's ready for that spotlight. I think if you add in Carmelo and then, and then Kuzma, then Kuzma blasts off. But just and Mr. Davis and LeBron all the way to the finals. 
Ooh, and the roster is also not befitting of what I consider a championship team. There's still some slight changes that are needed. All four sports, my decision is clear. Let's get Carmelo and then figure out what we can do for a leaping power forward center in the free agency market. Maybe put him on a practice card. Maybe let somebody else go. There's a lot of opportunities. Off work, DeMarcus is injured. Where do the Lakers go? I'm gone. Mellow.